Now, Fox Carolina First Alert Weather with meteorologist Catherine Noel. Good morning, everyone. We do have a first alert weather day in place now just for the mountains, though. So this has been changed recently because we actually were taken away from the air quality alert in the upstate. So this is great news improvement, at least for the upstate. But you'll still probably notice those hazy skies out there this morning. And especially if you are in the mountains, the air will be probably uh, not the best. Let's just say dangerous for those sensitive groups. So especially I'm talking to the elderly, you know, for children, anyone with heart, lung issues, asthma for sure. So you do want to limit your time outdoors today, especially if you normally go on that walk, that run, maybe keep it indoors this morning, especially in the mountains. This is where we have that air quality alert in place until midnight yet again. Starting to see some improvement with the hazy skies. You can see that blue color there. That's what we want to be in. We want to be out of it really all in general, but we'll take the blue over the yellow and the orange. So improving air quality as we head into the rest of the day. But on Friday, we could start to see some of that worse air that smoke another batch of it basically move on in from Charlotte down barely clipping parts of the upstate. So it is an evolving situation. First alert radar though showing also we're a little wet at times this morning. That's going to be the case as we go on really I would say mid to late morning too. we start to get improvement by six, seven o'clock. If you're going to be taking the dog out, whatever you're going to be doing this morning, especially across the upstate from Greenville, Spartanburg, you do have a chance of getting a little wet. So keep that in mind. Anderson potentially seeing the rain in Spartanburg South around eight to nine, 10 o'clock from Lawrence off towards Newberry, but getting clearing to the sun. Spotty shower is going to be possible throughout the afternoon, but afternoon looks way dry compared to at least this morning. We're going to be warming up nicely going from Temperatures in the mid 60s for the upstate around 8 o'clock by noon, low 70s, and then by 3, 4 o'clock, low 80s. Mountains, though, by 8 o'clock, 57 degrees, mid to upper 60s by noon, and then low to mid 70s is where we tap out later on today. Beautiful the next couple of days, Friday, Saturday, great weather here. We're talking sunshine and highs in the mid 80s for us to low 80s for the mountains, even a mid 70 tomorrow starting to get a little warmer. You can see into the weekend. Sunday's looking nice to at least to start the day. So we're going to be dry Friday and Saturday. Beautiful. We get high pressure in place, but by Sunday, this is when things start to change. We wake up still dry and sunny by the evening. We get cloud cover to move on in and then comes that next batch of scattered storms too with our cold front pulling in throughout Sunday into Monday, bringing us a chance of scattered showers and storms. So Sunday evening, if you have plans, dinner plans to be outside, may want to rethink those, but Sunday morning brunch plans will be just fine. But those storms will continue at times into Monday before we get the beautiful weather Tuesday and Wednesday, much drier and warmer too. First alert weather day in place today for the mountains due to poor air quality from the Canadian wildfire smoke. That's what we're going to be tracking all day long. Otherwise looking beautiful up until Sunday evening with storms continuing into Monday for you.